I need popcorn. Ugh, no, that sounds so good. But too bad we ate the last bag yesterday. Oh, yeah, right. Uh-oh. Another popcorn craving. Did someone have a bad day? Bad is an understatement. Let's just say we had another flying cheese incident. Ew. Ew. Uh, do you want to hear something sad? I've been working there for three years. The only person who's been there longer than me is my manager, Malcolm. Okay, okay, I know what you're going to say. <laughs> do you really? Mackenzie, we've been over this before. I know, I know, I've just been so busy. Wait, so you haven't even completed your checklist on Aussie Solar? Yes, and no. Mackenzie, the application period for Aussie Solar closes in a month. I know. I've been meaning to get to it. Well, did you at least go through the checklist on Aussie Solar? Yes. Okay, and why haven't you submitted it? Well, that's the thing. I still need one more thing. What is it? It's my letter of recommendation. Are you serious? Mackenzie, that's the one item on the checklist that takes the longest to get done. It took me three weeks to get my recommendation last year. N no, I think I got it. So who are you going to ask? Well, since I'm in such a time crunch, I'll get Malcolm to do it for me. Malcolm? Malcolm isn't your manager at Wings R Us. Malcolm's reliable. Okay, don't get me wrong. I like Malcolm, but I think your letter should come from someone who knows you a little better. You know, I was thinking the exact same thing. How about my mom? She can write it tomorrow, and then I'll be all done. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, someone who could speak on your academic and your professional experience. I mean, you're applying for an internship with NASA. Oh, I see your point. This is super important, Mackenzie. A good letter of recommendation can be the difference between getting the internship of your dreams or hanging out with Malcolm at Wings R Us all day. You're right. I should be taking this more seriously. I hate Wings R Us. Yeah, so who else can you think of? Professor Billy! <gasps> You're right, Professor Billy! She'd be perfect! She's been my math instructor for three semesters, she's my faculty advisor, and she nominated me for the Bill Gates Scholarship last year. <laughs> and surprisingly, you're never late for her class. Yeah. Wait, how'd you know that? Let's be real. It's the only time I've ever seen you up before 9 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> so when are you going to ask her? Well, I have math tomorrow morning. Maybe I should ask her then. Sounds like a plan. So do I just go up to her and ask her? Mm, that's usually how you ask people a question. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, you need to prepare a student biography before you go to her. A what? A student biography. It's a... Why don't I just show you? So basically, it's a list of your major academic achievements, awards, activities, things like that. You know, so your recommender can refer to it as they write. You should also consider attaching your resume. That is super smart, Nikki. Well, last year, when I applied for NASA internship opportunity, Dean Whitney wrote me a great letter of recommendation. She even complimented me on my student biography. Wow. I'm even more impressed that you even thought of this. Now, wait a minute. I'm not that smart. I got it from the AHEC website. They included it as part of their application supplement when they advertised for the One Stop Shop initiative. Sweet. But you took the compliment from Dean Whitney anyway, didn't you? I kind of did, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> All right, so that should be easy. I'll work on my student biography and get Professor Billy to send the letter to NASA. Send the letter as in post it? I should give her some stamps. That would be such a nice touch. Did you even read the information on Aussie Solar? Yes. I know. <laughs> Mackenzie, once you submit a request for Professor Billy to write a letter of recommendation for you, she will then upload it on your interest profile. Wait, what? I didn't know they could do that. Yeah, and then from there, you could check it all out when she's done. That is fancy. That's technology. And if you really want to impress her, send her a thank you letter. There's your nice touch <laughs> right there. <laughs> So back to business. You have a student biography to fill out. And I have an American Indian Studies midterm I need to study for. You mean right now? Right now, Mackenzie.